there is a creature that has been rapidly invading and destroying Australia. It has the ability to kill humans and even escape death from predators. This is the Great Cane Toad Invasion of Australia. Cane toads are an invasive species that were brought here in 1935 to help get rid of cane beetles. Originally only 102 of them were brought over here and now it's estimated that there are over 200 million of these guys. This species have flourished in the Australian habitat and they don't have many predators because not much can eat them because their poison is so potent. The other day we went to a local market and we even found that these guys are being sold as souvenirs which just goes to show how dense their population is and how much of a problem they've really become. These guys are a perfect example of how messing with nature and the natural ecosystem of the planet never ends well for us. Now they are nocturnal so we're going to wait around a little while until it starts to get a little bit darker and see what we can find. Now we found one here, it wasn't very hard to find this guy, they're absolutely everywhere where we are at the moment. Now these guys are instantly recognisable because of their poison glands just behind their head. You can see them just poking up. Now it is said that their poison is so potent that it can kill somebody in 15 minutes if ingested. So if you do touch one of these guys, you've got to make sure to wash your hands and this is why these guys are such a big problem here because nothing can really eat them. So they're just spreading like wildfire. Some animals have adapted to, such as water rats. They've learnt to actually eat the insides of them so they're not ingesting the poison from the skin. Now it's very easy to forget that it's actually us that caused the problem these guys aren't to blame. Sure, what they're doing is pretty horrendous to the ecosystem, but at the end of the day, they're just trying to live and we're the ones that put them here. Now, in most other countries, frogs and toads are very easy to identify from one another. But with these guys, they look very similar to some frogs. Of course, there are other frogs that look quite different, such as the green tree frog instantly recognizable as a frog. These guys are quite strange looking. 